Cooking, 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 I see, I see the syllable, you know, no one, I was tell but yeah, I see you, you know what I mean? And if you aren't too young, if you aren't too young, you know, Umetsu ring and get three, like his friends with no lean, so get team. If you know three talk, What's good? DJ Lab here. Welcome to it. This is the first installment, the first installment of Decoded. What's Decoded, you might be asking yourself. Here we break down your favorite South African rappers, lyrics on your favorite tracks, yeah? We set it all off with Uzagwa featuring Casper as well as Musiholic. This gem dropped for the first time in September 2017. But as they say, classics just don't die, man, you know? And it's never too late to get into this joint and find out and dissect to go see what your favorite MCs were saying on this one. Let's go. Like, I, like, I actually don't know if this song is a war cry or if you know, trouble up her in the account, whatever it is, it's lit. I mess with it. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, 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 high energy out the gate, man. Uh, if you know anything about Uzagwe, yeah, man, you know, Kasi rap, Zagwe is synonymous. At some point, I'm sure, Nong and Anfisa, you know, or oh, you'd manage to find a way of finding your roots or a link, you know. To being Wawamash, some way, somehow, like the way that this homie picked up Ilogishi, second, second, second to none. Second to nine, all the late grades, like this dude really did the things to make Ilogishi, like, seem cool, you know, at least in the hip hop era, like in a big way. Logish Sili Shoga Bila, Utse Otsing Fusi Logish, as he always does, you know. Vutis Kupunga, Pinambi Logish. I see, I, I, I see the word play. I see, I see the syllable, you know, no one, I was tell you, but yeah, it fit, I see you, you know what I mean? And if you aren't too young, if you aren't too young, you know, Umetsu Ring and three, like, his friends with Nolin, so get teen. If you know three talk by Nolin, I'm not going to go into it and butcher the rest of her name, but yeah, you know. I feel like, I feel like there's, there's some issues that are about to be addressed or some issues that are being addressed. If you look around, if you look around Uzagwe, there's his homies, his boys, uh, the artists that he's been working with from the get-go that are still there. But yeah, man, in the back room, the management, 
you know, there's been some changes. Mklasimpe, you know, those are the ones he's talking about. Who knows? Because I know he's not talking about other rappers. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. So it's Nezaz Ziavu, my star. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah. Izaz Nezaz, did you do your Bible studies? Did you go to Sunday school, guys? Yeah, man, when Jesus was born, you know, that comparison. Yeah, there were three wise men. Izaz, less, you know. Santoligela, I said, as model, see in Bulel. Um, yeah, he's as those three wise men know who to star. Oh, yeah, and they followed him. I lost the money I fought for your pain. Losing the ones that I want was a shame. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, man. He lost the money that he fought for in pain, you know. We know how the game does uh, artists a lot of the times. You know what I mean? Like, some people have their, their business down right and they still get screwed over. Some people don't have the business right. And, you know, it looks like, you know, game, you know, whether it's their team. We've seen recently how many artists are coming out and saying, yo, I signed into a bad deal, etc., etc. You know, so he's saying what he lost all the money that he fought for in pain. You know what I mean? And losing awards that he won was a shame. So this could this could be twofold. One, the fact that when he came out, he had no peers in the game. Like Batinya Koma was literally, literally, literally like running its own race that year. This is 2012. As memory serves me correctly, there wasn't anybody else popping as hard as like that joint. So when it comes to awards time, um Chitagashai San like blue like nothing, nothing. It's just like this dead silence and awards are going to a whole lot of other people. Even people that weren't doing hip hop seem to pick up awards that year. Or the fact that the awards that he did eventually take home are no longer in his possession and he's sitting with old management. I don't know. You make up your mind. Now that you're losing, your loss is my gain. Go and be great with the boys that you made. <laughs> now that you're losing, your loss is my gain. Yeah, he knows something we don't know, man. Yeah, I feel you, Zawi. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay to be mad, dog. It's okay. It's okay, especially if somebody did you dirty, my G. Boys that you made. If my balls was easy, be gone for his lane. I'm bowling easy with guns at the game. If I did see none, and go hold her. Wait, now you know me better. I don't hold it back. I'm like a stormy red. I try to stop me never. Now the story tell her. I'm a golden setter. Wine is on the setter. Hold her. Wait. Yeah, man. He's saying, yo, man. Like bad weather, you know the storms we've we've had. You can't hold the man back. And if you look at it, jeepers, the amount of reinventing of himself that this dude has done through the sounds and the producers that he's cool to work with, you know, then K Master Days and moving on to working with pretty much anybody, oh and uh, to oh, Musicholic now, you know what I mean? Like he's 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 cool with reinventing himself through the sounds, but never puts down his pen. You know what I mean? The lyrics will always be there. You know what I mean? And he still goes after the heavyweights. He's on a track with a, you know, a Stogie T, you know, shamelessly. Like one of my favorite joints to come out of South Africa, period. You know what I mean? And he's on a track right now with the Casper. He's on, he's on joints with everybody, everybody who's legendary in the game. Me and Twana, the OGs, whoever. And he's managed to keep up with the kids that are coming out now even. You're not holding this dude back like stormy weather. We know all about bad weather. Yeah, man. Nobody don't know the wine is on the set. I hold up. Wait, who does it better? Your son, I know my care. I cast in the last letter. I spend the last letter. Now we're never clever. Gold your mind just ever. Go and I'm gonna get him. This is my turn. Mana, 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 mana. Cast in the last letter. Man, I guess I this one is for you, buff. Uh, yeah, man. The last letter I I definitely knew of back in the day was Zubs. Are we saying he's put down the the the, the pen? And you 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 are the the main last letter now. That's cool. I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that. Nobody better to replace him than you. Showcase. <laughs> Yeah, man, I think um, Zagore laid out the story of how Casper actually got onto this joint where it's like they dropped a snippet. Yeah, yo, and I think Kumchita caught wind of it or heard it somewhere. And yeah, he was in the DM on some yo, 
Gishang or Uber on that joint for sure. You know what I mean? And that's dope. And I think beyond the power of social media, like just collaboration, Do you know what I mean? And that's dope. And yeah, man, first two lines in, the energy is right. And yeah, man, said yes to the right dude. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, man, again, we're addressing somebody. We're addressing someone on this one, man. A couple of lines in. Who's our favorite rapper, Kaz? So, yeah, man, says our favorite rapper is good at selling dreams. If you know, 2017, September, when is this joint drop? I think the peak of his and uh, a certain Mr. Forbes's beef um, had been realized. And he was dying down slowly. But, you know, you kind of want to get in those last couple of shots, you know, even when the fight is over. You know, keep doing your thing. And, yeah, do the selling, was good at selling dreams. What dreams did he sell us, man? In any case, uh, him, him talking about himself becoming a man at 17. We know the rundown, dropping out of school, you know, going out there to hustle, make, make it out there in the big, bad world. Yeah, he's come a long way. And yeah, man, it's not looking bad, my G. Yeah, man, he ain't good at selling records? Come on, dog. You saying, you saying homie didn't sell records? Or he's, he's okay at it? I don't know. I feel like he did his thing, you know, in his time. You know, you definitely did your thing as well, my dude. So yeah, man, we used to struggle with a fella, no? Like he's saying, he used to. Why is she zeal, you know? Yeah. What's a glung, a lasso, go pondo? We'll talk about Lolo Pondo some other time, but in any case, like Jomo Besho would say, yeah, man. When's a Ben's a Pella, man? It's a fella, no. Yeah, you are an extra nigga, bro. Yo, yeah, I know. Switch to Rolex to an AP. Wait, wait, wait. Switch to Rolex from an AP. I'm still trying to get a Rolex, dog, and you out here talking about auto Mars. Like a Rolex, if it's an LA if it's a BC keep after two years. Like an auto Mars, like price of a house. All these bars, it's just flexing, man. Telling you, Google him, he's the man. You know what I'm saying? Nothing fake about him. Check the jewelry. Because, yeah, a lot of your peers have been running around with a lot of fake things. You know? We see, we see, we see, we see all those zirconias. Yeah, boy, and all these dudes. Check the bank balance, not the bulletin. Win by any means. Uh, win by any means, rather. I'm a hooligan. Your last fight says otherwise, my G. <laughs> but it's all good. You win some, you lose some. As long as you made your bank. I got no match, so they hit on me. Yeah, I can't take that away from you, man. Like, in terms of the hustle, the business, yeah, definitely, definitely up there. Filled up domes, filled up stadiums, like, and did your thing, you know? I think Ngalizi Nkati, he was, like, two Bentleys deep, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, he was definitely, definitely on a high, definitely doing the damn thing. Why Sazos are like, Teguin? Another story for another day. I know, man, you for gazy. Y'all delusional. Y'all are crazy. You are infants to me. Y'all are babies. Seems like every rapper is a sinner now. now. Hey, well, that aged uh, a certain way. Yeah, I agree, man. Seems like a lot of rappers are singing now. I think even Orkand, they've now created a melodic rap category. A lot of dudes belong in that. You know what I'm saying? I feel like it should be called something else, man, because rap is rap. But in any case... I was born a loser, I'm a winner now. Kegan Jale Lobo 70. Kegan Jale Lobo 70. Kegan Jale Lobo 70. Kumli Lo Salango Parafi. Kegan Jale Lobo 70. Kegan Jale Lobo 70. Kegan Jale Lobo 70. Kumli Lo Salango Parafi. Kokul Poko Kikin Kikin Kai. Kokul Poko Kikin Kikin Kai. Kokul Poko Kikin Kai. Say, this thing goes from just like being like. You know, from being a warning shot to like a straight up like war cry. Hey boy, learn to learn. It goes from Kosa to like Xe. Yeah boy, si akona gege manje. Gyoli wa yona limp. Beautiful, beautiful joint. Production, execution. Like, didn't take themselves too seriously with the pen, but still got their point across. Both MCs, both rappers. Um, yeah, man, it was really nice. And you can tell Luguti. 
they took their time from the get-go, from when the joint was made. Because I remember the first time I heard this track, so I was Ashu, Bridge City, you know, Zawe. I don't know if they were still testing the joint out because there was hardly a hook even. Jumped on stage, dropped that beat. I had to go over to him and say, say this is it. whatever this is, this is a hit. Like, this is the next joint, this is the next hit. You know what I mean? And I guess a whole lot of people reacted the same way. This is one of those tracks, oh my God, like eight, ten times in a row at a concert. Think niggas in Paris, yeah, Jay-Z, no Kanye. And Ingatlik, like, just the hook alone, just the right amounts of repetition, the right, the nice, the right things to repeat in any case. You know what I'm saying? Like, when the energy's right and the room is full and the sound slaps just right, this track really does the things, man. And the verses you can rap along to, you can keep up with, and there is still a message in there, man. As much as, as fun a track it is, it's like a party joint slash whatever. You know what I mean? So yeah, this is definitely the one. Shout out Maziri, shout out Kaz, shout out Musi, shout out everybody that was involved in this one. Shout out, shout out Maziri. Um, yeah, man, thank you for allowing us to review that one. That one was dope, man. He actually sent me the right lyrics because, hey, genius, do your sort your lives out, man. Right? Genius. Yeah, everybody who's out here populating these lyrics for these joints, man. Talk to the homies, bro, because some of them, hey, they're demelizer. But yeah, shout out. Nice. Loving the penmanship. Loving the playfulness of it all, man. It's one of those tracks that you don't take too seriously, but yeah, it's still does the damn thing it's a hit for sure it's a smash you know what i mean definitely a smash and one for the ages hopefully you enjoyed that one so what we're going to be doing slightly differently is that we're going to be giving you know the rapper who was on the track a chance to actually tell you exactly what he was saying on the rhymes you know after we've checked them out and deduced what we wanted to deduce. but it's always nice to get it from the horse's mouth so that is going to be called the last word and right now the man himself uzagwe on the last word Oh yeah, Shapo Zek Mafoy Tuzagas Nang now represent just to break down U17 straight to the point how 17 came about. Um, Nang Zete Win Mina Bafoy to Besem Pumalang and Mang Fidem Pumalang be record because we had a studio there. Um, Abafoy to Unkulumango Musicholic XYZ, Mzulu Suspect, Mzwa. MPK, you know, Mang Fi Anga Le Bang Zisim Kumak Tuala Le La Le Ngomia She. So music holy was like, this is the song that's gonna bring us our back. Nya Thailand Banan Dalui Tate Pudam, you know. And I was like, ah, man, this is your breakthrough. Same as Figa. A, a back to the city, Casper Nyavest heard us perform the song, you know, and it DM'd me, it's like, hey, voice, let me male, I heard it. Um, the, the last song that you performed, I want to jump on it if it's not finished. Um, sent him the beat, he sent the verse back, and then I laced my verse. So, what record kala, my record after, you know, the song is pure bliss, it's a blessing to me. Shout out to Musicholic, you know, shout out to XYZ, who were like, voice, to see nigga, you know. So, the the song is basically about um all 17 you know all 17 being negative people abantu abohlezi bekutshela ukuthi you'll never make it in life ngoba ufail u grade 7 kazi yolunga yini ka grade 9 kazi yolunga yini yolunga yini ka grade 11 you know and you get there uh, we are passer, you know. Uh, Abanya Bakchelu, I need Fagilis Viam La Pambon, and then I, the Louis Yagelian, do my yeg, you know. So it's all about Abandu, um, Aba Pigelilayo, Abangabella, Los Seventeen and Bulin, Abanda Bakchelu, as soldiers are Pumelela, you know. Just to break down the verse, um, out in Fusil Logish, if foot is cooping up in Nampi Logish, Gushit to Zoom up his army, no need. Zishang ain't no dying, having no lean, and then ring on the three like I'm friends in no lean, you know. Mang it's a Zishang ain't good, dying, having no lean, and then ring on the three, three talk with no lean, you know. Ninning Bakuza will fail in Ganin, I never lose in the battle of mean. Lababa push up a penis damn and his as is Yafuma is done. I mean, it's Damina, it's da, I mean, and Zenza Bangam for my daughters and fame. I lost the money I fought for in pain. Losing awards that I fought what was a sh losing awards that I won was a shame. Now that you're losing, your loss is my gain. You know, now that you lost me, the song, uh, that verse was specially dedicated to um, my previous manager and, and business partner, you know, to say, I get, now that you lost me, so born with you know, and the, the only lines were dedicated to Mfuitu and Repa Nai Manja, Sensei Nai. 
alba manje was to say um I just wish you'll realize this before it's late. You know what I mean? I hope it was on fire before it's late. And it happened, you know? It was just a prediction to say, um, now one day, we were born and we born and we were born and you know? Not to say that I'm ungrateful for the things that we've worked on, you know, but it was just that, okay, man, you must have come to the focus shifts. Now you're born and then short. I think it was just some type of um, management skill. I have a week lap, you know, or now I'm coming up and please young as, you know, so the song was about that, um, dedicated to about for to dedicated to people and each other with about for it to bang jigger and let's just cut, you know, um, uh, look. Losing a was that I won was a shame. Now that you're losing, your loss is my gain. Go and be great with the boys that you made. If my balls was his, he'd be gone before it's late. You know what I mean? So yeah. And then um yeah, the next thing is just it flowing, just a rapper. It's a rapper. The song is basically about showing people who would um ingoma in a vibe doesn't have to be weak lyrically, you know, in terms of word plays, in terms of double intentions, punchlines and whatever. So Elon does see portrayal up an orchestra, but you know, as much as it's a vibey song, but the lyricism is on point you know so yeah man the song is basically about that and then the subject matter is just to kulu manjong 17 if there's anything you guys and in fisu uti mlisha mengi break it down kuyo ni um yeah just hit up on my they'll let me know and then i'll break it down but for now my name is zago strong now represent a salute Get ready for the album it's dropping soon all right not too far off the mark yeah yeah i think we'll click you see it here and there he was just trying to be nice he's a nice guy but it's all good um so yeah that was really dope on today's decoded looking forward to the next album that you're talking about and when that album is done you bring it here and we decode the whole damn thing so yeah man if you at this point of the video and you've watched the whole thing send us your suggestions in the comments below letting us know which tracks you want us to decode yeah it's been dope peace